Welcome back. The weather has been gorgeous across much of North Central North Dakota for today, even at Lake Metagoshi looking good, not just with that light wind, but we're getting the nice fall foliage. A nice little view of that across much of the Peace Garden State. Even outside of our studio, we can see the nice array of colors with the leaves at 73 degrees. 74 in Karlsruhe as well as Mohal. You have the Magic City beat by one degree, but eventually temperatures will be falling down into the 60s over the next hour or so, but conditions will remain calm for high school football for tonight. All across the region, we're in the 70s, still a few 60s being reported for Williston into Hedinger, but more, overall, we're looking at pretty decent weather for the moment. Take a look at our evening forecast. Not looking too bad. We'll be in the 60s when about the next hour, light wind out of the southeast, so not looking at any type of weather trouble. And that's going to be the case over the weekend. The only exception is going to be a slight chance of a shower or two. But for tomorrow morning, uh, many of us are going to be falling down into the 40s to start out your Saturday, but then rising back up into at least the mid 70s for Minot, as well as Bismarck and Dickinson. Williston, if you're heading west, they'll likely be dropping or at least rising into the up the lower 70s. A little bit on the breezy side tomorrow, um, especially across western North Dakota. Central North Dakota, um, not very much wind, but Williston Dickinson, the Highway 85 corridor, that's where they can have some 20 to 30 mile per hour gusts. So 70s for your fr Saturday. Sunday, we've got our next disturbance pushing through, which could bring a few early morning showers to some parts of northern North Dakota, otherwise remaining dry and warm ahead of that frontal system. And this will be our best chance of getting those upper eight, upper 70s rather, and low 80s for the second half of your weekend. But for Saturday, low to mid 70s, near 80 or slightly above for your Sunday, then everything changes after that. Um, a light southeast breeze for tomorrow, maybe some 20 mile per hour gusts for Minot, lighter wind on Sunday out of the east, and then a northwest wind behind that front on Saturday, on, on Monday rather. Precipitation chances over the weekend, not that great. We're remaining dry for Saturday. Sunday morning, as I mentioned, maybe a little bit of spotty shower activity, a little more as you get to Williston, but notice we're not expecting very much of any accumulation, and that's only if you're lucky enough to get the rain, but the chances for Minot are very, very slim. So we'll be falling into the 40s for tonight, tomorrow afternoon, low to mid 70s with a rather sunny sky. So overall looking not too bad, but the changes are underway as we go into the middle and end of next week as we start to see not only a few chances of showers, but also some cooler temperatures, low 60s for highs by Tuesday, Joe, and then only 50s for next Friday. Oh.